I'm sorry. I tried not to do that. I guess I'm in trouble. Why would you be in trouble? Well, I'm supposed to be in school. Does that mean you're not going to tell? Well, you know, sometimes it's more important to figure out what's bothering somebody than having a perfect attendance record. Either way, it's cool, but if there's something you want to get off your chest, you know, you can tell me. I guess I can tell you, since it is about you. Partly, anyway. Me? Did I do something wrong? Oh, not to me, but you did make a mistake. And everybody's acting like it's the worst thing in the history of the world. Like they're all perfect. It's a joke. Anyway, I see how they treat you. And how no one cares that you're really hurting. And they took something away from you that was really important. Your family. I'm just a stranger. What'll happen to me if I screw up? First, let me tell you how touched I am that you even took the time to think about me. But I'm okay. At least I'm going to be. I mean, I'm not saying that it doesn't hurt. But, you know, life goes on, right? Sometimes these things happen for a reason. Do you ever hear that saying that one door closes so that another one can open? I think it's true. I mean, I realize that my family behaves in mysterious ways. But they are also capable of deep love and loyalty. I guess sometimes, you know, when you mix business and you mix family, uh, things get kind of messy. You know, people's feelings get overlooked for the higher cause. But they did the right thing, Emily. How can you say that? They kicked you off the foundation. Yes. They did. They did it because if I stuck around Emily, it might adversely affect the progress of the foundation. The, look, the bottom line is, if I stuck around, something else might have gotten screwed up, so I just can't be there. But you're still sad. Yeah. I probably will be for a long time. But I don't want that to rub off on you, okay? I don't want you to project I don't want you to think that the way my family's treating me has anything to do with how they feel about you. Because, kiddo, they really do care. And I'm going to tell you something. When the chips are down, you can't do any better in the world than to have the Quartermains in your corner. Don't forget that. So, what do you think? Maybe we'll give school a shot? I, I could write you a note if you think that would help. That'd be great. Okay, give me your notebook. Never done this before. Emily, I'm not really uh, too sure what to write. Thanks. How about the roof caved in? Uh, you know, actually, that's probably a little too close for comfort. Why don't we stick to the basics? Um, you got a queasy stomach. Perfect. There you go. Thanks. Okay. You're a cat. AJ? Yeah. You'll be all right, really? Yeah. Yeah, I really will. You, get out of here. Go to school. Go learn something. Have a great day. That's in order. Aye, aye, Captain. All right, beat it.